Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to Open More Toys. Today on OMT, we have a Spongebob episode. We have a Funko Pop Spongebob toy. And then we have a five pack of Spongebob figures called the Hall of Fame. And then we have this giant Play-Doh surprise egg. And it's made to look like Spongebob. I made it myself with Play-Doh. It took me a little well, a little while to make it, probably like an hour, hour and a half, but I'm pretty happy with how it came out. But first, let's go ahead and open up this Funko Pop SpongeBob SquarePants exclusive from Hot Topic. And the reason it's exclusive from Hot Topic is because this special uh, Funko Pop toy will glow in the dark. So, I pretty much like all the stuff from Funko Pop. I think they make their toys and their characters look very unique. So they make really good like shelf display pieces. This Spongebob piece is no different. I think it looks pretty cool. Like it looks like Spongebob, but it also looks like a, a different artsy version of him. It's really neat. Fortunately, with my camera and my lighting, we won't be able to see how it would glow in the dark. And I don't know if my camera would pick it up anyways. All right, next up, we're going to open up the Hall of Fame Spongebob 5 pack. I picked this up at Toys R Us. Not, and it, what's weird about it is like not all the Toys R Us I've been to have SpongeBob toys. They're pretty hard to find, but this one did. So after we open up this five pack of SpongeBob characters, let me know who's your favorite by writing it in the comments. Alright, first up we're going to take out this Spongebob character, and this is Jelly Fisher. He's got a little net and he's trying to catch jellyfishes. And this Spongebob is wearing his, uh, his glasses. It's pretty cool. Next up we have Spongebot, little robot version of Spongebob there. He's got little light bulbs for eyes. Total rocker Spongebob. He's got his awesome glasses and spiky red hair and he's jamming on the guitar. And then we have a Spongebob character which I thought was pretty funny. He's looking back at the back of his pants and uh, well, he has a little tear in them. It's kind of funny. It definitely looks like somebody took a little bite back there in his pants. Then we have our fifth and final SpongeBob character in here, and he's really, really muscular. This is Muscle Bob. He's got huge muscular arms. See if uh, SpongeBob with his big arms can open up that Play-Doh surprise egg there. See if he can punch through the Play-Doh. <laughs> All right, I think it's time we go ahead and take a closer look at our giant Play-Doh surprise egg. It took me a while, but I think I got most of the details there with the Play-Doh. All the little uh, nooks and crannies of the SpongeBob character. Pretty happy with how it came out, but we're gonna have to open them up to see all the toys inside. So right away I can see a, a chocolate egg bear and we have some Skylander toys, a Finalmation, some Toki Doki stuff. So we're gonna have to get all this Play-Doh off and open it up to get a closer look and see what we get. First thing we're gonna open up is a little Toki Doki, Toki Doki toy here. This is a Punk Star Frenzies, and uh, they're little keychain toys that look like little like punk rocker people. Oh, 
awesome. We got a little Tokidoki character. He's got black spiky hair and he's jamming on the bass guitar. It looks like he can go ahead and jam out with that total rocker SpongeBob we got earlier. Let's take a look at him side by side. How about that? Some people have asked me to do some Skylander stuff, and I don't have the video game, but I was able to find these Skylanders Giants puzzle erasers. And this puzzle eraser is supposed to look like Crusher. And there's two other characters that I have that I picked up that has a total of three puzzle erasers, and I'll do those next time in other videos. So let's go ahead and open up this bag, and he's in all his little parts here, all his little eraser parts. So I'll go ahead and assemble them and show them to you right now. So here is Crusher all built from Skylanders. And he, like he is a Skylanders giant, this is a giant eraser right here. Pretty cool, I, I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. Really heavy hammer. Let's go ahead and open up this uh, well, this is a D Cool Superheroes, and this is Wolverine here, and it's uh, something I found online. I think it's from China, but it's supposed to be like Legos. I guess this is the Chinese version of Legos. It's D Cool. But uh, I've opened up some of these before. I did a video, but I didn't ever post it, but it was League of Legends characters. I thought it was pretty cool. I'll see if I can go ahead and find that video and actually edit it and bring it out. And here's our Wolverine pack, and I'll go ahead and assemble him. Here he is, all done. Wolverine, I'm pretty happy with, he's, with how this came out. His hair is pretty neat. He's got his little uh, beard there and little mask details on the back. So they did all the details, and his claws are pretty cool too. Let's do another Marvel toy. This is a Marvel mini bobbleheads blind bag, and there's four characters to collect. And after I bought these, I didn't realize, but I actually have these same things that are not blind bags, which I'm going to open up later. So in this one, we got Spider-Man, and Spider-Man's head with his big bobble head is very wobbly. Pretty cool. I'll probably put that on my dashboard of my car or something. Then we have another... Tokidoki toy, this is Royal Pride. A lot of you have been asking me to do more Royal Pride stuff, and uh, here we are with a Royal Pride box, and the box looks like a little subway cart, but we'll have to open it up and see what toy we get inside. Now all the toys in here are like either like punk rockers or other things that you might find at like a subway station. So, let's go ahead and open it up. Alright, it looks like we got a little black business cat. So it's a black cat in a suit and tie and he's reaching into his coat for something and he's carrying his little suitcase that says Toki Doki. There's a little mean face on him. I wonder what he's reaching for in his jacket. And then from Adventure Time we have this awesome blind tin can. For a blind box toy, this is awesome because the can itself is like a toy. So this tin can is the Ice King, and there's other tin cans like the main characters and things. And I'll go ahead and do open up those in a, maybe an Adventure Time Surprise Egg video. If you want to see an Adventure Time Surprise Egg video, write Adventure Time in the comments. Alright, let's go ahead and see which character we got in our blind bag here. Black hair. It looks like we got Marceline the Vampire. So these are pretty cool toys from uh, from these blind boxes. I think they're pretty well detailed and pretty neat looking. Go ahead and put her on top of the Ice King there, and we'll open up our next toy. Next up, we'll open up a Spider-Man Chocolate Surprise Egg. So, this is a piece of chocolate I can't wait to eat later. A little knock knock on here, see if we can crack this open without crumbling it. Oh, guess not. Crumbled it into a lot of pieces. Oh well, it's all gonna go in my mouth later. <laughs> and then 
then we have this little capsule that has our little Spider-Man toy in here. So we'll check that out. First, here's the checklist of all the characters that you can get inside these chocolate eggs. And here's our first hero. Now, who can tell me the name of this Marvel character? This might not be easy, and it might be easy for some of you who really know Marvel characters really well. If you know the name of this character, write it in the comments. Now we have another blind bag. This is the Angry Birds Mashem. I think we've almost collected all the Angry Bird Mashem characters, but I could always use some more. Oh, awesome. We got the Blue Bird. So I could always use at least three of these Blue Birds to make this set. <laughs> the Angry Bird Mashems are probably one of my favorite Mashems because, well, they look exactly like their Angry Bird characters and they're super, super squishy. Now we have a Vinylmation from Toy Story. These are the Series 2 Vinylmations in Toy Story. And on the front and back you see Woody and you see Buzz Lightyear. And these are the characters you can get right on the side. Oh, how cool, we got the black and white version of Woody. And just like our last week's video, we're going to end the video with a little frozen surprise toy here. These are the, uh, the dog tag and sticker combos. So first we'll get our checklist and our sticker. So. There's our checklist with all the dog tags we can collect. And there's our sticker, and it's the exact same sticker we got last week. I wonder if we got the same dog tag. We do have the same dog tag as we got last week. So we got the same sticker and dog tag, which I don't mind because that sticker is really awesome. So it's great to have more than one. And this Elsa dog tag is definitely one of the best I think you can get in this series. Love the artwork here. So I'll just go ahead and probably put that off to the side and probably keep that with my other dog tag to put them with him later. That's all the time we have in this very special Spongebob episode of our giant egg Spongebob. And if you like this video, make sure to hit the like button down below. Give our video a big thumbs up and we'll continue to bring more videos to you. Well, I hope you like this video. That's all the time we have today on Open More Toys. And if you haven't already, go ahead and click right here to go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Alright, thanks for watching, and see you next time on Open More Toys.